Hello everyone. With luck, I'm going to be able to communicate the excitement I'm feeling right now at landing on an Okanagan College campus to begin my tenure as president. I'm incredibly eager to visit all of our campuses and learning centers and hopefully meet you in person to learn more about this great institution and the incredible opportunities ahead of us. As you can likely imagine, this is a very strange time to move into a leadership role with physical distancing, masks, and wondering how the next weeks and months are going to unfold for us, let alone the entire world. Even in a pre-pandemic time, taking over as a new president in the wake of someone as well-respected as Jim Hamilton would have been daunting, but today, even more so. What I have learned in preparing for this role from the far reaches of Northern Alberta is that Okanagan College has a strong culture of transparency, respect, and dedication to the community, and above all, a focus on student success and serving the communities of the region. I've been graciously afforded the opportunity to connect with Jim and other members of the executive here over the past number of months to ensure that there's as smooth of a transition as possible. Nevertheless, when I accepted this position, I promised that I would hit the ground listening. And that is exactly my plan, to listen and to learn. Fortunately, I come with an experienced set of years potentially the benefit of years in senior roles at other institutions and time spent in the front of a classroom. And while our circumstances prevent me from meeting the many great individuals that make up the college's community in person, I know that time will eventually enable me to do so. In the meantime though, know that I will be working through other means to be able to meet, to connect and to learn from you. Before I even get started, I know that it's gonna be an adjustment to a different way of operating and a completely new set of acronyms here in British Columbia. So bear with me as I learn these nuances. I promise I'm gonna to come to understand them and in time even contribute to them. Now I know that each institution has a distinct personality and I wouldn't be here if I didn't appreciate Okanagan College's personality and flavor. And certainly OC's mission statement completely resonates with me as someone who believes wholeheartedly in the transformative power of education. Now the months ahead are going to be busy ones. We first have to sort our way through the pandemic and chart the way into a post-pandemic reality. We will need to develop our next strategic plan. And while much of the work still needs to be put into developing the creation process, know that I will be turning to you for input, feedback, and opinion as the plan is developed. I am also hopeful that the planning process will give me the chance to meet many of you personally, either virtually or in person, depending on our circumstances at the time. Now, before arriving, part of my homework was to understand history. So I do know that Okanagan College will be celebrating its 60th anniversary of serving the region in a couple of short years. And I'm looking forward to working with you to think about and shape the college's future while we leverage and build on its incredible history. In the meantime, I recognize that I'm the proverbial new guy know that I will need to learn as much as I can so that I can contribute in the best way possible. And so to that end, please forgive me if you find me making the occasional mistake or referring to something in a way that doesn't make sense. For me to truly grow into the college, I need your help to provide me with feedback and know that I truly do welcome your feedback. I listened intently during Jim's retirement as, spe as speaker after speaker remarked on the respect they had for Jim Hamilton and Okanagan College. I also heard Jim emphasize that the success of Okanagan College has enjoyed regionally, provincially, and nationally were due to the tremendous commitment of the people that work here and the strong foundation we had to work from when he stepped into the role. Now I hope to build on this strength together. It's obvious this place means so much to so many and I can't tell you how privileged and genuinely excited I feel to join the OC community. I can tell already it's an incredibly special place to work and learn, and I can't wait to work with the people who make it that way, and that's you. In the meantime, I will be looking for ways to stay connected with people, meet people, and swap stories, ideas, and passions. So thank you everyone for such an incredibly warm welcome to the college. I'm looking forward to meeting you virtually or in person, but until next time, take care.